You know, I very much like the, the framework of the base camp here today. Uh, it's much more comfortable for people to walk from table to table. People are a lot closer together. Uh, exhibit halls typically with a 10 by 20 or 20 by 10 format almost presents an obstacle and, and change was needed. And so I think this is a, a good innovation by Leading Age. As a vendor, I would urge them to continue it. My number one goal, priority uh, at the event every year that I come is to connect with other providers from around the country and hear what unique projects, strategies they're implementing uh, so we can learn a little bit and uh, try and position ourselves a little bit differently here locally to, to serve our target population. I want to be the voice. I want to be a, uh, a loud voice that goes to the halls of the Senate and letting everybody know about aging and ageism and the prejudices and the work that we do is important. This is really the first time I've been to a conference like this. Uh, to try to absorb as much as I can uh, to take back to our board and, and back to our people back, back home, you know, what's going on in our field and uh, what I can do to actually contribute to the success of our organization. Coming to Leading Age is, is usually a highlight, and especially the peak, because I see people that I don't see year-round. I come from a small, small community, and it's a time that I can connect with people all over and feel like I'm a part of a large organization, not just a little corner of Kansas. Basically, Leading Age guides us in, in the new innovations, what's working for other people, that's working in other homes, that we can maybe initiate into our community, things that have worked, things that don't work and just sharing good ideas.